Grapes, grapes, and more grapes. This is our third grape recipe in a row. I hope you are enjoying them. Stay tuned. Hi, my name is Katrina. Welcome to the Organics channel, where we get together every week in the kitchen and we create delicious, healthy recipes. Today is a super, super good one. We are going to be making roasted grape oatmeal. Let's begin by cooking our steel cut oats. To a medium sized pot, add in three quarter cup of milk mixed with three quarter cup of filtered water. Cooking with milk creates a delicious creamy oatmeal. Add in one eighth a teaspoon of either pink Himalayan or sea salt and then over medium high heat bring to a boil. Stir in one half of a cup of steel cut oats, reduce the heat to low, cover with a lid, and then simmer for 30 minutes or until desired doneness. While the oats are cooking, let's roast the grapes. In a mixing bowl, add in one cup of red grapes. Drizzle with about one teaspoon of olive oil. Add in 1 8 a teaspoon of either pink Himalayan or sea salt, and then toss together to coat evenly. To a parchment lined baking sheet, add your coated grapes, and then place them in a 400 degree preheated oven and roast for about 20 minutes. Your grapes and oatmeal should be ready right at about the same time. This roasted grape oatmeal looks delicious, smells delicious, Let's see if she tastes delicious. Yes, indeed, that is absolutely delicious. If you've never tried roasted grapes before, I highly, highly recommend them. Mmm, and it's so good with the oatmeal. So some additional toppings could be maybe some chopped walnuts, some chopped pecans, maybe you want to add in some chopped up apples, maybe a little bit of yogurt, or even a little bit of sweetener like honey, although I don't think it needs any more sweetness. I think it's perfect. And then one more thing. If you want to double or triple the recipe for the roasted grape, part of this recipe and then save the leftovers in your refrigerator for other recipes. Mm, great idea. If you've never tried, I hope you do. It's so good. Thanks so much for being with me today. Hey, be well, make healthy choices, and I'll see you next week in the kitchen. Bye-bye.